Hey, hey, hey. My name is Catherine. I'm a beauty influencer with Pharmacy, and I'm going to do a quick makeup tutorial for you. I'm going to pull my hair back out of my eyes so I can see what I'm doing first. I've been with Pharmacy for a few months now, since the beginning of March, and I love it. I love the products. Yeah, they're just the bomb. So you always, always want to use primer. I'm going to use the VFX Pro Camera Ready Strobe Primer. It's a cream. Well, the reason you want to use primer is to cover your pores so that makeup don't get in on all that good jazz. This has a little shimmer effect to it. It looks like this is only my second time using it, and I actually like it. You want to make sure that you get your neck as well. You don't want mismatched face and neck. You want your color to go down your neck as well. Grab my towel that I use to get makeup off of my hands. <clears throat> Let that set for just a second. Now there's two different prim primers that pharmacy has. They have this silver one, if I can get it to not be so. That's the silicone based, and then this is the cream. They both are amazing. Amazing. All right. Next, I'm going to go in with the BB cream. It's um, literally um, a medium cover. It's not a full cover. This is BB Beauty Balm, and this is a lot to medium. Start. Can always add more if I need it, and I usually put on my eyes too, even though I use eye primer too. We have a lot of products that are very affordable and amazing. I was going to use my beauty blender, but I forgot to dampen it. So, you can use whatever your fingers, a brush. Beauty Blender. I think I got a little too much in my, in my hand. It's about time I'll grab a brush here in just a second to finish it. But look at that coverage. As soon as I get it on, it'll look so much better once I get it. How it needs to be. I think I use a little too much. See, I still have a lot on my hand that I'm probably gonna have to waste, but it's okay. It is all good. Now I'm gonna use my brush and just finish getting it. Blend it in. 
I just don't like how some brushes are. They scratch your face. That one was scratching. All right. I'm gonna mix a little bit of CC cream on top just because of the redness I have on my face. And the CC cream is a color control, excuse me, about hiccup. So this will hide that a little bit. This is also a medium coverage. But look. Okay, got that blended. Now let me dry my hands off. <clears throat> Next I'm going to put on some terracotta porcelain powder. It's a beautiful, it's beautiful. Just look at that. It's beautiful. It's a matte finish. All right, got that. Looking good. All right, next, I think I'm gonna go in with my Vice Brown palette. They've got such amazing colors, look at that. Look how pretty those colors are. Let me get some, put these up real quick. Is in my way. I don't just love my little peacock going on back here. <laughs> oh, first I have to put on my eye primer. If I can find it, I might have to use my brand new one because I've got so many things up here I can't find it. That's the eye primer. I was trying to find the one I already had open that I've been using, but I don't see it up here. It might be right in front of my face and I'm like not seeing it. So, oh, here it is. Right in front of my face, like I said. One of them days. It's Friday, y'all. Yay. How many is still working? I am. I've been working since COVID started. We haven't closed. We're just drive through. Today, we opened it. Yay. Not looking forward to that up for. I mean, people have been so rude anyways. And I'm just worried that it's going to get worse being open. You know how people are. But hey. I'm staying positive, and yeah, it'll be a good day. It'll be a good day. Like to pop. Today was a good day, or whoever said that. I can't remember. All right. <clears throat> now let's get my eyeshadow brush. I'm gonna clean it a little bit. 
just to make sure I didn't forget anything. And I'm going to go in. I think I'm going to do this one as my transition color. And just tap the excess. And I'm going to go a little higher than my crease line because I've got the hooded eyes. If I can get this brush to work for me. Trying to create an illusion of not having the hooded eye look, but it's not wanting to cooperate. My brush is not working like I want it to. See right there? It kind of, yeah. Let's not use that one. Let me grab a fluffy brush. If you ever mess up, you can correct it. Um, if you, you know, you can use a corrector, concealer stick to correct it. You can see the difference at the brushes. Like this one, that brush just didn't do it right. And I'm using a windshield wiper motion. Okay. Now we're even. All right. Now I'm going to clean the brush. I'm going to go this one like right here and then the other one will be on the corners kind of like a, trying to do a smoky look Let's clean it again. Because I really like how this one's applying the colors. Then we we'll use this one for the outer part. I will blend it out in a second. Let's 
get another mm -hmm. brush and blend it out a little bit. Get another fluffy brush. I'm going to use this one because it's fluffy. And for some reason, the fluffier ones do a better job. It's crazy, isn't it? Blend that in. And again, I'm using the wiper motion to blend it. Okay, as you see, I've kind of got a little mess up. So, have no worries, have no fear. I've got a concealer stick. Look how cute this is. It's not lipstick, it's a stick. Light ivory concealer stick from pharmacy. It goes on pretty good. And I'm gonna use this kind of like a highlighter too. I am not a makeup artist, y'all. I'm still learning tricks of the trade. And then I'm gonna go right here and kind of war paint it look for a minute. I'll get a little right here. And then right here, Cupid's bow. And I'm gonna go right here and do a little bit down here. You can do the same for contour too, but I'm using it totally different. Then I'm going to use, I'm going to wipe this off. And I'm going to use two brushes. All right. You can let it marinate for a few minutes. It'll get into your... Thing. It just gets into your... Yeah. Look. There we go. That's what I'm trying to say. Right there. See how it's blending in? See the difference? Sorry, y'all. I've got the TV on in the background. I thought I'd turn it down. I must have not. If y'all can hear it, I apologize. Watching Baby Mama. It's a funny movie. Tammy Faye. She is hilarious. Or Tina Fey, I mean. Got it blended. Next, let's do these eyes. I'm gonna clean this off. Uh oh. 
There it is. All right. I've got another one coming from pharmacy. So excited. I've got quite a bit from my makeup collection from pharmacy. Their brand is unbelievable, y'all. Um, yeah, I can't stress enough how great pharmacy products are. Um, they're lightweight. I can barely tell that I have anything on. And I've got the BB cream, the CC cream, the concealer stick, the terracotta powder. All right. I'm going to use the Extreme Curl. It's new. Well, it's new to me. I got um, Zen, which is unbelievable. And the 3D effect, which is amazing as well. I love them. I love them. I love them. I love them all. All right. Look at this wand. Hold on. So amazing. Now let's see if I can do this without messing up. Look at that. All right, there's that. My eyes always water when I put um, mascara on. And I'm going to use, if I can find what I've done with it, my brown express pencil. Now, there's a trick to these. Um, when you go to sharpen them, put them in your freezer for a little bit. And when you sharpen them, it'll, get, it'll be so much easier. And I don't know what I've done with my sharpener okay i'll just use the dull it's okay it'll still work How beautiful that is. All right. Now I am going to I think it's this one. Use this lip liner with the uh, All Natural 203 lipstick, matte lipstick. It's kind of like a stain. It'll stay on there all day. You don't have to worry about retouching anything with pharmacy. Not 
I'm bad at lying. I think I needed the other one. That's all good. It'll still look good. Watch. And it blends with it. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. All right. And I'm not doing any blush. Well, actually, I could do blush. Let me find my sweet almond blush. Here it is. And this blush can also be used as eyeshadow. Let me wash this off. Beautiful, isn't it? And last but not least, the Tom Locker Satin Spray. You don't need a lot. A little bit will do the trick. And you're ready to go in under 30 minutes. So, what do y'all think? Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, please, so I can get more followers and go live sometimes. That'd be awesome. All right, I'm going to jump off here now. I want to thank you for watching my video. Um, Y'all have a great day. If you want to shop any of my products, my link will be somewhere in the description or the comments or somewhere. Um, please give me a follow. Y'all have a blessed day. Thank you.